Following widespread public concern over cases of thrombosis among vaccine recipients in European countries, health activists welcomed Putrajaya's decision to roll out the controversial AstraZeneca vaccine on a voluntary, first-come, first-served basis. Former Deputy Health Minister Dr. Lee Bun Chai said with negative coverage undermining confidence in the AstraZeneca vaccine, it may deter people from enrolling in the immunization program. Overall, the AstraZeneca vaccine is still effective, safe, and beneficial, he told FMT. If recipients, especially those above 60, want to get vaccinated earlier, they can go for it. Lee said Putrajaya should also consider allowing the private sector to take over the administration of the AstraZeneca vaccine for those willing to take the jabs. Galen Center CEO Azrul Mohamed Kalib said the opt-in voluntary stream for the AstraZeneca jabs would allow many who are anxious to be immunized to get the vaccine. He said the government had taken on a pragmatic approach and pointed out that the vaccines were certified as safe and effective by the National Pharmaceutical Regulatory Agency. Let the people have the option of getting vaccinated earlier with the AstraZeneca vaccine or wait for their turn through the Mysajatra process. Azrul said the odds of developing thrombosis from the vaccine was only 0.0008%, much lower than taking contraceptive pills, smoking, or getting infected with COVID-19. He added that the opt-in plan strengthened the case for providing people with a private option for vaccines.